In this problem, we're going to use the quadratic formula to solve the equation 6 equals 4x squared minus x. Now, with this one, when we use the quadratic equation, we want one side to equal 0. So I probably want to move this 6 over. That would be the easiest way to do it. So I'm going to subtract 6 from both sides. I'm writing the 6 over here because 6 is not like 4x squared or x. It's not a like term, so we can't combine those. So 6 minus 6 here is 0. We want that. That's going to equal 4x squared minus x minus 6. We have our quadratic formula. x equals negative b plus or minus the square root of b squared minus 4ac all over 2a. A refers to the coefficient, the number in front of x squared. So a is equal to 4. B refers to the coefficient, the number in front of x. We have negative x, so that's a negative 1. So b is negative 1. And c is the constant by itself, so we have negative 6. OK, so let's substitute these into our equation. We have x equals negative b. So that's like a negative 1 times b. Easy way to think of it is just whatever the sign of b is, change that sign. So in this case, we're going to change negative 1 to just 1 plus or minus square root of b squared, so negative 1 squared. Okay, so we're going to subtract 4 times a, which is 4, times c, which is uh, negative 6. And that's going to be all over 2a, so 2 times 4. So let's simplify this a bit. So we get uh, x equals 1 plus or minus. Negative 1 squared is 1, as I mentioned before. Minus 4 times 4 is 16, times negative 6 is going to be a negative 96. And that's all over 2 times 4, which is 8. Now notice here we're subtracting a negative. Subtracting a negative is like adding a positive. So I'm going to change those both to positives. And I'm going to write this as x equals 1 plus or minus the square root of 97 over 8. Uh, I don't think we can break apart 97. Um, so we're just going to leave the two solutions as x equals 1 plus the square root of 97 over 8. And x equals 1 minus the square root of 97 over x equals 1 minus the square root of 97 over 8.